Hello everyone, welcome to Afro News South Africa. Please kindly subscribe to our channel and share our videos. Please turn on the notification bell so as to be notified when we upload a new video. Thank you all for their votes for the ANC, if they this guy run for P-R-E-S-I-D-E-N-T opinion. South Africans have been making it clear that they're tired of the ANC and want them gone due to the perceived failures of the ruling government opposition parties similar as the EFF have been trying the stylish to have the ANC step down but has still failed as new political parties similar as Action SA have also joined the battle. The immigration extremity of South Africa and the chaos that have surfaced in the former weeks have also formed a base for which party to bounce for. The EFF and ANC have been the least favorite for the people due to their pan-Africanism state, while numerous believe they would know a bounce for the ANC again, some are still willing to bounce for the ANC handed that Aaron Mozzoletti runs for chairman. Looks like he's the only person that can save the ANC Aaron Mozzoletti has earned himself a lot of sympathizers following his station on the immigration extremity and the prejudiced media in South Africa. People believe that he's the only minister in South Africa that really cares about South Africans. One person said no man, Minister Aaron Mozzoletti, should be removed from his position. In fact, it's too low for him. He should be president of South Africa. So he would apply his sense on everything. What a brilliant person. Numerous others that reflected after this person stated that they would indeed bounce for him if he was to run for president. While there are veritably low chances of him actually running for president, South Africans believe that he could be the only stylish thing that could be to South Africans. At the same time, Aaron Mozzoletti could be the person that can save the ANC as he's the only person that South Africans like. Tita Teet, I would bounce for the ANC with or without him. No party so far has proven itself to be the better party to take over so far. The so-called RET forces, who were lying with embattled Secretary General Ace Magashul, released a disturbing dossier just history, detailing a plan to shut down the entire country. Still, it appears that this isn't the only plan they've up their sleeves. The National Executive Committee of the ANC has pushed Magashul in a corner by stating that all members facing severe allegations should abdicate within 30 days. The RAT body as a total will suffer greatly as a result of this move. The RAT and President Cyril Ramaphosa appear to be at odds ideologically, and there's a sense that they aim to take the struggle to the party's branches as attempts to recapture the party's soul are enhancing. Member Nathy Sithole of the ANC believes, the President Zuma might be averted from speaking at any future ANC conferences or platforms because of his support for the radical profitable metamorphosis.